Today we'll be solving the equation the square root of x plus 11 plus 5 equals x plus 4. We want to get rid of that square root, but we can't until it's by itself, so we have to move the 5 over to the right side by subtracting 5. We're left with the square root of x plus 11 equals x minus 1. Now we can square both sides. On the left, that gets rid of our square root, leaving us with x plus 11. And on the right, we get x minus 1 times itself. Foiling out the right side gives us x squared minus 2x plus 1. Now so that we can factor this and solve for x, we want to set this equal to 0. So we move the x to the other side. And then we move the 11 to the other side. So 0 equals x squared minus 3x minus 10. The factors of negative 10 that make negative 3 are negative 5 and positive 2. And then we set each of these binomials equal to 0. Solving for x gives us x equals 5 and x equals negative 2. We have to check these solutions to make sure they aren't extraneous, so we are going to plug them back into our equation. We get the square root of 5 plus 11 plus 5 equals 5 plus 4. We have to evaluate this and not move anything across the equal sign. And working this out gives us 4 plus 5 equals 5 plus 4. And this is true, 9 equals 9, so 5 is a solution. Now we're going to test negative 2 by plugging it back in. Now we get the square root of 9 plus 5 equals negative 2 plus 4. That becomes 3 plus 5 equals negative 2 plus 4. And 8 does not equal 2, so negative 2 is an extraneous solution. Our solution to this equation is x equals 5.